Hello, I am Luke Pagel, Inside Sales Specialist here at Rexnord, and I will be teaching Rexnord.com Gear Drive Interchange Selection Tools. Rexnord's Gear Drive Interchange Selection Tool has developed to utilize an application's engineer's expertise to select and configure a gear drive quickly and easily using another manufacturer's data provided from a gearbox. The Gear Drive Interchange Selection Tool is useful to you because if you are given the exact drive you want to interchange, you can use this data to build the Rexnord version. Once this is built in the selector tool, you can generate a quote, view the details on it, or even order it. Today I received a call and I'm working out with a customer to replace an SEW KH87 and we know this box has a torque arm. To start, please navigate to rexnord.com and log into your account. If you do not have an account, please view the registration training to get you set up. You will need to be logged into a rexnord.com account to use the full capabilities of the selector tool. Please remember, end users can create the end account as well as our distributors. To access the gear drive nomenclature selection tool, please navigate to the resources tab on rexnord.com, then select selection tools. Next, you're gonna select gear. We know this one is gonna be an SCW right angle interchange, so we will select the right angle gear drives, then click interchange for the Ultramic gear drives. After clicking on the selector tool, we will be brought to the launch page for the selector. To begin, we have the option to select the gear manufacturer of the gear drive we are interchanging. This field is optional to select, but if you do specify it, it will narrow down the options in the following fields. We will select SEW as our example. Next, we need the gear drive model number. Notice that you can click here and find it and scroll, or you can type in, we will be looking for a KH87. You'll notice that once we have selected the gear drive model number, some of the following fields are automatically filled in for us. If there is an exact match based on our selections we have made, the tool will fill in and gray out as many fields as it can to expedite the process. We will move on to the configuration field, which is the next for us to fill out. We will select option J with a torque arm bracket. The next is output shaft. We will select R, straight hollow bore with a shrink disc. Next one is the nominal ratio. This list includes only the ratios that will, are supported by Rexnord. Choose the option that is closest to your application. We will select 50. Notice that once we have selected our nominal ratio, the number of reductions field has been filled in because that is the only option available. Next is the input type. We will select option A, gear drive with a flange motor adapter. Next is the drive mounting position. As noted here, this is Rexnord specific. We will select option two. If there are any questions on our mounting positions, please contact Rexnord's customer care team for assistance. Finally, we need to specify the ambient temperature that our drive will be installed into. For our example, we will select 80 degrees Fahrenheit. We can go ahead and click the next button at the bottom of the screen to proceed with the next step. In this step, we need to specify the motor information. First is the competitive motor frame number. Please note that this list only contains the competitive motor frame supported by Rexnord. For our example, we will select the DRN132S4. You'll notice that the rest of the information on this page has been filled out due to the exact matches. We can proceed by clicking next. Step four allows us to add additional features to the gear drive and select the low speed shaft options. Notice that the fields have been filled in with the information we have provided in the previous steps. Of these fields, there is only one we want to alter, that being the low speed seal type. We will change from a single seal to a double seal. Next, we can go to the general product type. From here, you have the option if you would like Rexnord to supply a motor, you can select yes and you may be asked to fill out the horsepower and you will be asked to fill out the motor manufacturer and the motor conduit box position. For this one, we're gonna select no. After that, you have the selection to change the paint type. If your drive will be exposed to any extreme conditions or wash down conditions, here is where you want to select that. We will stay with the standard. 
If we have any additional paint colors, you can change that below. Next is if you want the drive pre-filled with oil, we can make that selection here. For this one, we will stay with no. Following that is our lubrication type. Depending on the application your drive will be installed into, you may need something other than the standard lubrication to fit your application, such as food grade lubrication or synthetic lubrication. With our current configuration, we will stick with the standard lubrication. The following two options are tied together. Whether you want a backstop, and if you do, what is the direction of the low speed shaft rotating? For this one, we do not need a backstop, so we will not have to fill out the direction of the low speed shaft. And the last option is for a premium breather and lubrication options. These are limited by the mounting positions we have selected in step two and for us are grayed out. We can click next to continue. After we click next, the configurator is building our drive and is displaying our drive here. If you are logged into your rexnord.com account, you can view the nomenclature, price and weight and add it to your cart. From here, you can generate a quote, view inventory, or order the product. We also have the option to email your configuration to ourselves. Scrolling down, we can view a 2D and 3D CAD model that we have of the product that we have just configured. Once added to the cart, you have the option to create a quote, add to a list, save the order, or continue shopping. Thank you for watching Rexnord's gear drive interchange selection video. For more information or documentation, please visit rexnord.com or subscribe to Rexnord's YouTube channel to stay up to date on installation, maintenance, and all other Rexnord videos.